explosion of two munition ships in San Francisco Bay shocks the world. An explosion recalling this harbor blast in Bombay, India, three months ago. The new American disaster happened near Port Chicago, a town of 1,500 population, 30 miles north of San Francisco. The earth-shaking explosion happened at night, killing 321 persons. These films, passed by Navy censorship, tell an appalling story of the wreckage of the Port Chicago Naval Magazine. Damage to Navy property alone is estimated at over $6 million. The two ships, the Canalt Victory and the E.A. Bryan, were torn apart by the blast. Amazingly enough, bombs still rest in an ammunition train near the dock. Huge pieces of jagged metal were blown for miles. In the town of Port Chicago, not one building left undamaged. Clocks were stopped at explosion time, about 10.20 p.m. Strangely, only two persons were injured when this theater's wall was blown in. Desolation everywhere. A few hours before, the air was full of flying glass. Every window in town was broken. The big job of reconstruction begins. A Navy Court of Inquiry takes steps to discover the cause of the strange and terrifying explosion which injured at least a thousand, some of them Navy men asleep in their barracks. The mystery will probably never be solved, for only small pieces of the ships remain.